2024 Dacia Duster adds hybrid power and double bed. The no-frills SUV, which has a more robust design, has lost its diesel engine. If the styling looks familiar, there's a good reason for that, considering the 2024 Duster is inspired by the oddly named Bigster introduced in early 2021. This is an almost spitting image of the concept, which will evolve into a larger model positioned above the Duster. Looking more rugged than its predecessor, the simple SUV features extra plastic body cladding and stronger skid plates to enhance its outdoors in nature. The Y motif has been adopted for the headlights and the rear door handles are integrated into the C-pillars. At 171 inches, 4,343 millimeters, long, the new Duster is almost the same length as its predecessor. However, this is a true next-generation model as it uses different underpinnings, moving to the more advanced CMFB platform. Thanks to more modern architecture adapted from parent company Renault, packaging has been improved to increase cargo capacity by 6% to 472 liters, 16.6 cubic feet. Additionally, rear passengers have more legroom than before. For added practicality, the optional roof rack can support up to 176 pounds, 80 kilograms. The interior does away with fancy materials and keeps it simple with hard plastics that should stand the test of time. These don't look nice, but Dacia's aim is to develop a durable cabin while keeping costs low. We wouldn't go so far as to call the interior Spartan, as there's a 7-inch digital instrument cluster and a 10.1-inch touchscreen tilted slightly towards the driver. There are also up to four illuminated USB ports, wireless smartphone charging, a six-speaker sound system, and wireless Android Auto and Apple CarPlay support. We're happy to see that there are still traditional buttons for air conditioning settings, and there are plenty of old-style controls on the steering wheel too. The smartphone holder flanked by two screens is a common Dacia feature today. In the rear, the optional sleep pack comes with a fold-out double bed as well as a desk and storage space. Dacia says it takes less than two minutes to set everything up. You won't find a diesel engine, as Renault's tried-and-tested 1.5-liter DCI is obsolete. Instead, the 2024 Duster will be offered with the TCE 130 unit as a turbocharged 1.2-liter engine. This three-cylinder unit operates on the Miller cycle and adopts a mild hybrid setup. It can be had with front-wheel drive or all-wheel drive with a six-speed manual transmission. Dacia says that fuel consumption has decreased by 10% compared to the non-electric version of the same engine, and performance is now better. The ECOG 100 engine runs on liquefied petroleum gas, LPG, and can travel up to 808 miles, 1,300 kilometers, with a 50-liter gas tank and a 50-liter LPG tank filled to the brim. The first is located under the rear bench, while the second is located under the cargo floor, so luggage capacity remains unchanged. It's not just that LPG is much cheaper than petrol, as Dacia CO claims point two emissions are reduced by 10% compared to an equivalent engine running solely on petrol. The most important innovation in terms of powertrain is the adoption of the hybrid setup inherited from the jogger wagon. It combines a naturally aspirated 1.6-liter engine with two electric motors, a 1.2-kilowatt-hour battery, and an automatic transmission. One of the e-motors produces 49 horsepower, and the other serves as a starter-slash-generator. The Duster Hybrid 140 supports regenerative braking and the powertrain always starts in electric mode. Dacia claims that fuel consumption is reduced by 20% on average and up to 40% in urban driving. The Romanian brand estimates that you'll be driving in EV mode 80% of your time in the city. The new Duster remains capable beyond the ordinary, offering 8.5 inches mm of ground clearance for the AWD model. It offers a 31-degree approach angle and a 36-degree departure angle. 
It even has a downhill cruise control system that will automatically adjust the speed to ensure a smooth descent. It operates from 0 to 17 miles per hour, 30 kilometers per hour, and can even be activated when reversing. There are also five driving modes to choose from, auto, snow, mud slash sand, off-road and eco. The third generation model is planned to go on sale next year.